Hello friends, I'm Parwis and this is our second video in Qt5 C++ GUI application development. In the previous video we have covered how you can uh, install Visual Studio 2015 and how you can uh, install Qt, the latest version of Qt framework for making C++ GUI applications. Uh, now uh, in this video I'm going to uh, show you a simple console application a uh, hello world console application and by QT5 and QT5 uh, so uh, in this video we will not touch the uh, GUI section but we are going to just uh, make simple console application and in the next videos we will touch uh, the uh, making GUI applications and QT5 framework using C++ language. Uh, now I'm going to create a new uh, file or project. You can simply create from here or you can create from this section and you can go to the project and you can click on new project and now you can see that in here we have uh, uh, we have application and in the application we have widget application, console application and these are uh, QT quick applications that we can use uh, QML language that is a Qt markup language for making uh, GUI applications in Qt framework uh, and now this is the library you can add library and this is you can add other project uh, for for example for testing uh, your application and some other uh, these are non Qt projects also you can import uh, get clone and some other uh, things okay now uh, we're going to just work on Qt console application and I'm s selecting the Qt console application choose and I'm going to give a name uh, hello world like this and in here you can browse that where you want to save I have created a folder at name of Qt project select folder now click on next uh, click on next now you can see I'm using Qt 5.11 uh, and also th this is the latest version of Qt also I'm using MVC 2015 64-bit micro, uh, Microsoft Visual Studio 2015 uh, next and finish uh, now you can see this is uh, we have our hello world uh, project and this is uh, right now I am not going to introduce this but in the future videos in GUI videos I will introduce this this is a dot profile and this is our source folder and we have a main.cpp file in here uh, this is simple the include of uh, core application uh, from QD5 library and this is you can see end main we have in C++ language and in this section uh, we have created a Q, um, core application uh, now if I run this and you can run from here uh, let me, you can see that now we have a console application uh, let me write something uh, I'm going to include a library that is uh, qdebug it is for debugging or for writing in uh, something in console it's like C out in uh, C++ and uh, in C sharp we have console dot write line or in Java we have uh, system dot print line. Now I'm going to uh, Q debug and in here uh, I'm going to write hello uh, Qt5 C++ application. Okay. Uh, now uh, I can run this. You can see that in here I have a debug and a release mode. Uh, you can, if you want to re release your application, you can choose release, and in debug mode you can uh, choose debug. Let me choose uh, debug and let me run this. Save all. Now you can see this is our our first Hello Qt5 C++ application. Uh, thank you guys this was our first video uh, this was just a simple console application and in the next video we will watch the GUI applications if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos subscribe to my channel